Hey guys, today I'm going to do the 100 questions no one asked tag and there's a bunch here to answer so I'm just going to get started. <sighs> Question number one, do you sleep with your closet doors open or closed? We keep our closet door open. We keep it open. My husband keeps it open. It's his closet. My stuff is in a whole separate room. Question number two, do you take the shampoo and conditioners from the hotels? No. Number three, do you sleep with the sheets tucked in or out? I don't like the sheets tucked under the mattress, but I do like them tucked under my feet. Have you ever stolen a street sign before? Um, if it is not connected to the pole or to a wall and it's on the ground, it's technically just picking up litter, right? Number five, do you like to use post-it notes? I don't use post-it notes at home too much, but I do use them at work sometimes. Number six, do you cut out coupons but never use them? I got into extreme couponing kind of for a couple weeks and I did really well. I had one ticket where it was just nothing but zeros, but I usually um, use coupons if I cut them. Number seven, would you rather be attacked by a big bear or a swarm of bees? If I were to survive and not get hurt at all, a bear because it would be cool, but realistically, probably a swarm of bees. Actually, I don't know if I'm allergic, so I don't know. Neither. Number eight, do you have freckles? Yes, I say I'm like a banana because I'm yellow. I'm Asian, and I have freckles, and bananas have little brown spots, so I'm like a banana. Number nine, do you always smile for pictures? I smile. I can't do any of the, like, modelly poses, like, mm, mm. I don't even, I don't know, not like that, I don't know. Yes, I smile. Number 10, what is your biggest pet peeve? I can't think of my biggest pet peeve, but I don't like drivers that drive under the speed limit. Number 11, do you ever count your steps when you walk? I count them sometimes. Number 12, have you ever peed in the woods? One time when my husband got our truck stuck into a big mud pit for five hours or so, I really had to go. So. I kind of found my way into the woods and I, I went. Number 13, what about pooped in the woods? No, I've never pooped in the woods. And I'm not laughing because I'm lying, I, I promise. Number 14, do you ever dance even if there's no music playing? Yes, I like to do stupid little dance moves and like sing stupid little songs that don't even exist all the time. Number 15, do you chew on pens or pencils? No, I've never, I used to bite my nails, but I never got into like chewing pens and stuff. Number 16, how many people have you slept with? Is that anybody's business? I'm married. <laughs> Number 17, what size is your bed? We have a queen size bed. Number 18, what is your song of the week? I don't really have one song that I listen to a lot, but there was one song that came on the radio on my way home, and I can't remember what it's called. Uh... I don't know. I just normally listen to the radio, though. Number 19. Is it okay for guys to wear pink? <sighs> Generally, no. I think only certain guys can pull off wearing pink. If you don't look extra manly to where it kind of balances out, then I would definitely say no. Number 20. Do you still watch cartoons? I like to watch Family Guy and American Dad when I go to sleep. Hey puppy, boom, boom. hi baby. Number 21, what is your least favorite movie? There's one movie that I can think of that I know I just did not like at all, and that is Cast Away. I think it was like three hours long, and there was no talking barely, and it just dragged on forever, but it's one of those movies where you just commit two hours into it, and you just need to finish it to see what happens. I don't like those. Number 22, where would you bury hidden treasure if you had some? I'm not telling you. Number 23, what do you drink with dinner? When we go out to eat, I always, always order water with lemon, extra lemon, and if we're at home, I drink water. Still. Number 24, what do you dip a chicken nugget in? I only eat chicken nuggets at McDonald's pretty much, and I always get their sweet chili sauce. 
Number 25, what is your favorite food? I, I don't think I have a favorite food, but if there was one food that I would have to have for the rest of my life and not go without, it would have to be rice. Number 26, what movies could you watch over and over and still love? My favorite kind of movies are romantic comedies. They can't just be romance because, ugh. Number 27, who is the last person that you kissed or kissed you? My husband. Number 28, were you ever a boy or girl scout? I was never a boy scout, and I was never a girl scout. Number 29, would you ever strip or post nude in a magazine? Number 30, when was the last time you ever wrote a letter to someone on paper? Me and my friend Maddie from high school in Hawaii, we've been writing letters for years now. Um, we still do it every so often, and I actually just visited her in D.C. not too long ago. Um, you should check out her channel if you haven't heard of her already. Her name is LaMadeline, and she's super cute and sweet, and I I'm sure you've already seen her videos, but if not, make sure to subscribe. Number 31, can you change the oil in a car? No, but I can take it to Walmart or the Ford dealership and they'll do it for me. I know how to do that. Number 32, have you ever gotten a speeding ticket? Yes, I used to have to drive home on the weekend to go see my husband, who was my boyfriend at the time, and it was an hour and 40 minute drive and the speed limit was super slow and I would just miss him so much that I would go 25 miles in an hour over the speed limit and I didn't get caught and then I did get caught and then I got into a lot of trouble. Number 33, have you ever run out of gas? Um, no. <laughs> Number 34, favorite kind of sandwich? Um, lately every morning for breakfast I have been eating peanut butter, Nutella, and banana sandwiches. Number 36, what is your usual bedtime? I don't have a usual bedtime. Um, it can range anywhere from 11 at night to 2 in the morning that I normally go to sleep. Number 37, are you lazy? I don't think I'm a lazy person. I think I have lazy days or just times where I choose to be lazy. Days off, especially. Number 38, when you were a kid, what did you dress up for Halloween? I think the most memorable Halloween costume I had was when I dressed up as Dorothy, I had the dress, and I have freckles, but my mom painted on, like, um, bigger freckles, and I had the red sparkly shoes. Number 39, what is your Chinese astrological sign? I'm not sure, but I think I am either a ram or a sheep. I was born in 91, so whatever that makes me. Number 40, how many languages can you speak? In high school, yo, tango. Cuatro clases de la espanol, pero mi espanol es muy malo. <laughs> Number 41, do you have any magazine subscriptions? I have one or two subscriptions. They're teacher magazines that I got for free when I got teacher's insurance for one of my classes at school. Number 42, which are better, Lincoln Logs or Legos? I would say Lincoln Logs just because I have a memory of when I was mean and I knocked over my cousin's Lincoln Log house and I made him cry. Number 45, ever watch soap operas? Yes, when I was little and my mom really liked to watch Days of Our Lives, I would watch them with her and I got really hooked but then I just eventually stopped watching. Number 46, are you afraid of heights? I'm really weird in that I do, I am afraid of heights, but I love roller coasters, but if you take me to the mall on the second story and have me walk near the railing where you can see down to the first floor, I freak out and I can't walk backwards towards it and it, it's just weird. I feel more safe on an upside down roller coaster. Number 47, do you sing in the car? Yes, but only if I am alone. I can't sing to save my life. Happy birthday is even a struggle. Number 48, do you sing in the shower? No. Number 49, do you dance in the car? I, if I'm with my husband, I dance and I do some silly little moves. Like that. Number 50, ever use a gun? Yes.
Number 51, last time you had your portrait taken by a photographer. Um, I think it was in high school when I graduated. Number 52, do you think musicals are cheesy? Yes. <laughs> Number 53, is Christmas stressful? I don't think Christmas is stressful unless you're around someone you don't want to be around. Um, or just family that you don't like. I don't know, for me Christmas isn't stressful. I like giving my family gifts and spending time with them. Number 54, ever eat a pierogi? I think I had one pierogi and I think it was potato. A potato pierogi. And I think it was a pierogi. I'm not even sure if I'm thinking of the right thing. Number 55, favorite type of fruit pie? It would have to be apple pie with either ice cream on top or some whipped cream or something or plain. Number 56, occupations you wanted to be when you were a kid. I wanted to be an artist, I wanted to be a teacher, and there's something about grading papers that I thought would be really fun. Number 57, do you believe in ghosts? I hope they're not real. Number 58, ever have a deja vu feeling? Yes, um, it's happened a bunch of times, it doesn't happen often, but I think there's some scientific, scientific explanation for why it happens. I don't know why, but it does. Number 59, do you take a vitamin daily? No. Number 60, do you wear slippers? Yes. Slippers to me are what most people call flip-flops. In Hawaii, we call them slippers. They're called slippers. Number 61, do you wear a bathrobe? No, I don't, I don't know. I don't understand bathrobes. I wouldn't want to put on, like, this heavy towel coat when I'm all wet. Or do you dry off first and then put on a bathrobe? Or do you put on clothes after you dry off and then put on a bathrobe? I don't know how they work. Number 62, what do you wear to bed? Uh, normally a t-shirt. Number 63, your first concert. I think my first concert was probably a Daryl Worley, Daryl Worley concert that they had um, at Fort Bragg for the 4th of July. Number 64, Walmart, Target, or Kmart? Realistically, Walmart's my favorite. I go there at least once a week and I spend too much money. Number 65, Nikes or Adidas? I have Nike shoes and my running shorts are Nike, so Nike. Number 66, Cheetos or Fritos? I like Cheetos. Um, every once in a while I'll have Fritos, normally if someone else gets them, um, but they make your breast stink. Number 67, peanuts or sunflower seeds? I really like peanut butter. But if we're just talking about peanuts in its natural form or sunflower seeds, I would choose sunflower seeds. Number 68, ever heard of the group Tres Bien? Her? Number 69, ever take dance lessons? When I was in, I think, eighth grade, a friend of mine uh, was turning 15 and she had her quinceanera and her mom taught us how to do the merengue and the waltz. Number 70, is there a profession you picture your spouse doing? My, my husband is in the army and I see him doing his 20 years, at least in retiring and then going on into the civilian world and continuing the job he's been doing. Number 71, can you curl your tongue? Number 72, have you ever won a spelling bee? I've never been in a spelling bee, but I'm a pretty good speller. And when we play Cranium and we get the spelling cards, I do pretty good. Number 73, have you ever cried because you were so happy? I don't think that I cried at our wedding during the ceremony. Well, I did because there was a part that made me cry when I was speaking. But I don't know. Yeah, I, I probably have cried when I was super happy. Number 74, do you own any record albums? I do not. Number 75, do you own a record player? Number 76, do you regularly burn incense? I've never bought incense before, but I do burn candles. Number 77, have you ever been in love? No, I don't think I've ever been in love. <laughs> of course I've been in love with my hubby. Number 78, who would you like to see in concert? I don't think I'm a huge concert person really, um, but if someone wanted to go to a concert, I would go with them. Number 79, who is the last person you saw in concert? Um, Justin Bieber. Number 80, hot tea or cold tea? 
Um, I don't drink too much tea. When I do, it's normally the sleepy time tea or a green tea. Um, but I do like the Starbucks green tea frappuccino. It's my friend Maddie. She got me hooked on those with the little chocolate chippies inside. Those are super good. Number 81, tea or coffee? I'm a much bigger coffee drinker. I think I had two or three cups of coffee today with the Coffee Mate um, Peppermint Mocha Creamer. That is so good. Number 82, sugar or snickerdoodles? I don't even know how to answer that one. I've, I don't think I've ever had a snickerdoodle. Number 83, can you swim well? I can swim. I don't think I'm a great swimmer. I can't do like the butterfly and all that stuff, but if you threw me out into the ocean, I wouldn't drown. Number 84, can you hold your breath without holding your nose? Yes? Can't everybody? I don't know. Number 85, are you patient? I think I'm patient for most things, um, but 100% of the time, probably not. Number 86, a DJ or a band at a wedding? Um, I didn't have a DJ or a band at a wedding, but I would probably think DJ. Number 87, have you ever won a contest? Um, I don't think I've ever won a contest where you had to perform something, but there was one time where I did enter to win a microwave when I was under 18. I think I was 12 years old. And the lady called my mom, and she wanted to speak to me, and she asked me how old I was, and I said 12. She said, okay, and she put me on the phone with my mom, and you're supposed to be 18 to enter, and I didn't know, and, but we got the microwave anyways. Number 88, have you ever had plastic surgery? No, I have not. Number 89, which are better, black or green olives? Neither, they're gross. Number 90, can you knit or crochet? I can't, can't knit or crochet, but I can sew, kind of. I'm okay, I'm not like professional. Number 91, best room for a fireplace. I would say the living room. Um, it would be nice if we had a fireplace, but it's super hot in southern Alabama, so I don't think we will need one anytime soon. Number 92, do you want to get married? I hope so, because I'm married. Number 93, if married, how long have you been married? I've been married for a year and three months almost. Number 94, who was your high school crush? Uh, me and my husband met in high school and I didn't have a huge crush on him in high school, but I was very fond of him. And number 95, do you cry and throw a fit if you don't get your way? No, I'm not a two year old, but I don't know. I mean, not, no. 96, do you have kids? We don't have kids. Um, I have baby fever 24 seven and I really want kids one day, but I'm, I just want to wait until I finish school, which I'm almost done with and we're still young. So we want to travel and just enjoy, enjoy. <laughs> we just want to enjoy each other until we're ready. So we'll see. I'll let you know. Number 97, do you want kids? Uh, yes, I think I just referred to question number 97. Number 98, what is your favorite color? I don't really have a favorite color anymore, but I don't know. There's not really a color I don't like. Number 99, do you miss anyone right now? Yes, I miss my family. They're in North Carolina, and we're going to go up there for Thanksgiving. Thank goodness, because I miss them a lot, and I wish we were closer. Bonus Jonas question. Something that happened to you in middle school. Um, there was this one time in middle school, I want to say it was 5th grade, maybe it was 6th grade. 5th or 6th grade, and I was at a dance with a couple of my best friends. And a song came on, and my friend, she went to booty bump me, and she knocked me down on the ground, and I slid, like, a couple feet. I don't know, it was just really funny. <laughs> Alright, that is it. That's all 100 questions. Um... Yep, I don't know. I hope you enjoyed. Bye.